Yeah. Okay, we're going to go ahead and start our uh, webcam shootout. We're going to start with the Logitech C920. It's, it's like the latest, greatest that came out, so we'll just get right to things with that. Uh, we're going to currently doing this particular video on our higher machine that I've got in my specs under Greg S. And uh, on that particular unit there, the uh, motherboards, the Asus, the uh, P8Z68 Lux. Uh, you can look at the different uh, peripherals that I've got in that unit to see uh, what you might have to have in yours in order to get similar performance uh, out of using a chroma key. Uh, Craig S. did send me some links to different types of uh, color chartings and so forth for demonstration. I'll show these in the video. Later on, we'll crop these out and we'll put them side by side the digital picture uh, for some comparisons of uh, trueness of color and so forth. There's just one chart. Uh, we've got one other one here we'll, we'll put up there. Alright, well that's something to compare to. We'll do a little uh, freeze frame and cut those out and so forth. Uh, on our settings on our wirecast, we uh, set them to a higher performance settings. Uh, the canvas is a 1440 by 1080. Uh, the source settings for the cameras is a 1920 by 1080. Uh, however, to get any type of performance with our settings uh, using a quick cam uh, was uh, to 1280 by 720. We weren't really able to use 1920 by 1080. It was just too much. We couldn't get a frame rate uh, much higher than say 16 and 17. And currently with our settings we're getting right at 24 frames. Go ahead and hit that chroma key Mike. We've got this action packed uh, feature keyed up for you. Ability to hold color and uh, video. And uh, that's about that's it here for the uh, Logitech C920. And any additional questions and so forth, just put them in the post in the form. And uh, we'll just continue to check out the details of the different games. Uh, the next one we'll do is the Logitech C920.